partners in Atlantic City, Ken Shapiro, a bag man for the Philadelphia mob, mm -hmm. and, a, and a labor racketeer named Danny Sullivan. Those were his two partners in Atlantic City. When Trump Tower got built, 80% of Trump Tower was built with concrete at a time when all the skyscrapers in Manhattan had long since converted to building their high rises out of steel. Why? And uh, well, I mean, uh, you know, I suspect because he was getting a sweetheart deal from the mob. And why did he, as opposed to other other builders, not get that? You know, there was he needed to get concrete, and cut the concrete industry at the time was very mobbed up. Uh, he built a very palatial apartment for the girlfriend of a mobster named John Cody. And when, when Donald and I later talked about this once when we were down in Mar-a-Lago. Um, he said, you know, I went to John Cody and I told him what's what. And that guy never, ever messed with me because he knew who he was dealing with. And then he sort of pauses and he says, he's still in jail, right? <laughs> <laughs> because, oh you know, it suddenly dawned on, on Mr. Tough Guy that John Cody isn't somebody he'd want to tangle with in public. And, and he wanted to, you know, make sure that he was still in jail. Because Donald Trump, like every classic bully... If you push back or you stand up to a bully, they're often, it's often masking infantile weaknesses. He is not a tough person in some ways, and you scratch past the surface. But he fetishizes mobsters, you know? And we talked in the top of the hour about what he once said to me about John Gotti, that, you know, he sort of wanted to model himself on John Gotti, because John Gotti was such a tough SOB, he would sit in the courtroom and he wouldn't flinch and he wouldn't cry and he'd stare down the judge and the jury and that's how you should roll. And he's compared himself on the campaign trail to Al Capone. Uh, you know, so this is someone who has a cartoonish, juvenile and dangerous fixation on how mobsters are to be honored and how they roll in society and he models himself on that. You know, uh, Tim, let me come back to you. Um, I, I, what is it?